Welcome back to Let's Play Prince of Persia, Warrior Within. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time... Well... I went and defeated Kylina, and we saw the first of the game's two endings. That wasn't actually as bad as I was expecting. I would call that the okay ending. Now, uh, today, we're going to go and get the last of the health shrine upgrades, and then return to see what difference it makes when all those runes on the floor are lit up. Oh. I have a hunch it's in this direction. Because, well, if for no other reason, then I really, really don't want to scramble through the mechanical and garden towers again. So let's start with this. Embarrassing. Not a great start. Okay, that was... I'll stab you in the dick. Oh, and I found something out! This, uh, sword here, this glowy one. I didn't notice this when I was playing, and I didn't notice it in when I was going over the footage. But, uh, it was... Someone else pointed out to me, through the footage, that, uh, every time I hit someone with it, I take damage. <laughs> So that explains both why it's so much better than a scorpion sword, and, uh... I thought there was something hanging off the blade. Of the, uh, spinny thing, I mean. It explains why it's so much better than a scorpion sword, and it explains a few situations where I distinctly remember myself saying, how did my health get like this? Because I'd been very careful to avoid Kylina's attacks. The okay ending ended with, uh... A shot of Babylon and flames, so, you know, that sucked. I used to think that was Babylon. I remember the prince saying that's where he was from, anyway. It sure sounded like he was going home from the, uh... End cutscene. Oops. I forgot it's the uh, D-pad, not the sticks, when you use menu interactions. Okay, I, I didn't realize the timing changed. Where am I now? I don't actually remember this room. Like it all. He's the one the Empress wants dead! Very brown hair. We're supposed to fear this? Retreat! 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 
Yes, you are supposed to fear this. Is that the front door? Is that the, uh, door down there? I don't think I had Eye of the Storm at this point. Yeah, that's right, the very first time I... Oh! Ha! The very first time I went through, uh... This area... It was, uh... Would have been right at the beginning of the game, I think. And the first time I went through a portal, I earned the Rewind ability. Not the uh, Eye of the Storm ability. Hmm. You know what? This isn't seeming that familiar either. Hey guys. Next. Oh, this is the room where uh, I threw an axe at myself. I don't need it anyway. Weird that it's not activating, but you know. You will pay for this transgression. Hmm. Double. Hmm. That was a big room back there. I had a fear I didn't look into every goddamn corner. Yeah, this looks about right. Hmm. Hang on, what's that stuff up there? I don't even know if any of this footage is going in, because I don't want her to spend all day faffing around not finding anything. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, let me look around off-camera.
Okay, guys. I think I figured it out. It was all about that buton on the ground down here. Just want to know if there's any, uh... No, it looks like I took out all the pods already. Ah, well. Okay. Yeah, it's that window up here. The bars rise up when you push the buton. And it looks like I'm right here. Ooh. I think this, so uh, if I'd found this the first time, I'm not sure there was anything holding me back from it, except maybe not having that slow ability. Uh, I think this would have been the first time I'd encountered the giant smashy blocks. Oh no. Ugh. Fair enough. That was a poor choice. It's all glowy. Oh. It's not right there. Ow, oh, shouldn't have gone diagonally, god damn it. There it is! You gain life upgrade. As the print as the as the health bar increases, the prince becomes stronger. One last time. You know what? I'm actually a little bit disappointed that the health bar doesn't curve around at the very end, uh well, I guess it does only... you have to have one start point and one end point. It's not a, uh, a Mobius strip. Well! That's that taken care of. I guess I'll just go back. You know, I actually had to load a game from just before I got the second last health upgrade, too. I did that off-screen, because I figured you guys wouldn't want to watch me climbing up there and getting the thing again. <laughs> My organs. Uh, look at that. Made it through flawlessly. Aw, uh, yeah! Save that motherfucking game. <sighs> I'm glad there was a big honking button on the ground for me to investigate. Might have taken a while. At last! It really is ominous as on get out, isn't it? You know, I have definitely enjoyed finding out once and for all what this game is. The masses aren't entirely wrong when they say that it 
seems to miss the uh, the point of the predecessor and be all moody and violent. That's better. You have died! But, uh... At the same time, the platforming is still really solid, and you really can't deny that they... The changes they made to the combat improved things. I'm just trying to decide if I should like stop the video here and dedicate the last video to me just fighting the uh Actually I don't know if it's gonna be the Empress. I don't know what's going to change. I have turned the music down, uh, by about 10%. I'm hoping that when I get to the credits again, I won't be completely drowned out by, uh, the Godsmack song they play over it. Which, by the way, I was right, that did get copyright flagged, and, uh, as a result, the credits video is not viewable in Germany. My apologies. If you come from that region. All right, screw it. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Prince of Persia, Warrior Within, when we finish this once and for all. We brought hope back to the prince's life. But maybe we can do even better. Wish me luck, Burning Dog fans, because I'm going in.